What's going on guys? Welcome back to Days with Wade. I just wanted to give you guys a quick heads up that I'm about to kick off a brand new Europe travel series that covered our trip to Europe late December of last year to late January of this year. In light of that, I'm gonna quickly go over my top five reasons why you should film your trips away even if you're not planning on posting it on social media. So without any further ado, let's get into the video. Capturing and preserving priceless memories. When we go on a trip away, oftentimes there are moments that while it's happening, we don't realize how valuable that moment is. We kind of take it for granted being like, yeah, you know, we're out and about having a bit of fun, having a good time, but in actuality, we're making lifelong memories. The beauty of bringing a camera with you is that you get to capture all these special memories that might not seem like a big deal at the time, but become immensely more valuable as time goes on. The trip becomes more ingrained in your brain. You remember exactly where you went to, the names of every place, and how you felt at that time. Revisiting and reliving the small details. When I was filming the Japan vlog series, it was so fascinating fascinating because I got to relive the smallest of small details that make you feel so nostalgic. For example, a big one were all the sounds of a Japanese bus station. Does anyone go, oh, when we went to Japan, the sounds of the train station were awesome? <laughs> no, of course not. But you'll remember that because you went there and you experienced all those little details and those details matter to you. So when you revisit all that old footage, it makes you feel nostalgic and it allows you to relive it yourself. Getting off the plane in Tokyo airport, we saw all the Super Mario artwork stuff everywhere. I managed to really capture that exciting moment with the whole trip ahead of us. Now, did I remember that moment when I got home? Absolutely not, I forgot about it the next day. But having the camera there allowed me to capture that priceless moment. Seeking out interesting things. When you bring your camera gear with you, it gives you extra motivation to actively seek out cool and interesting things to do because you want to make your video as entertaining as possible. It also allows you to become more aware of what's going on around you because you want to take your camera out and film as many cool things as possible. So it just allows you to get a lot more out of your trip. Don't need to be an expert to make a great video. I look back at all the Japan vlogs I made and apart from being very proud that I made them, I realized that you don't need to be very experienced in filming and editing to be able to make a really good video that you and your loved ones will be able to enjoy for years to come. All I did before going to Japan was I went to a camera store, bought a decent vlogging camera and a few other pieces of equipment. And when I was in Japan, whenever I thought that I was looking at something cool, I would literally whip out my camera and film it. That's it. No extensive planning of how I was gonna get the right angle and if I was gonna pan left or right. Just literally pointing out my camera at something that looks cool and filming it. Reason five, it brings you closer to your loved ones. After editing all the footage, you can share all your videos with your loved ones and they can get a better idea and a better picture, no pun intended, of where you went and what you got up to. Also, it's something cool that you can show your future kids and let them know that, hey, this was me in my 20s acting silly, this is how it looked, and this is what it was like back in my day. And as time passes more and more, the video becomes more and more valuable, and it's almost like it's a snapshot of time. So that's it for my top five reasons why you 
should bring a camera and film your trips away. If you enjoyed the video and got something out of it, make sure to smash that like button and hit subscribe along with that bell so you don't miss another video. I'm releasing one video per week on the Sunday, so be sure to stick around for that. So what Wade wants to know this week is, have you ever filmed a travel vlog video yourself? Why did you do it? Or why haven't you done it? Do you want to do it in the future? Let me know in the comments below. And with that being said, thanks for watching and we'll see you guys in the next video.